content. Is there really anything more sacred in this world? It's the spice to our Arrakis, the thing that keeps this planet turning. And go. Hi everyone, let's go for another viral video on Spooktube. All right, <laughs> that's the intro. That's the intro. It was only a matter of time before someone turned making a video into a game, which thank God they did because now instead of spending my time making a video about a game, I can play a game about making a video. A video game, if you. This is the ninth circle of hell. We've reached the bottom. Culture is extinct. And I'll be honest, I feel like I'm dancing on the ashes right now. Film that, film that. Iron Maiden. What is that? It's Iron Maiden. Alright, get a little I'm closer. Gonna trigger it. I'm gonna trigger it. <laughs> Foul beast. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. What Mike, save him. Save him. Save him. What's going Ooh, on, guys? Oh my god, guys. I stayed up till Wait, don't three don't keep fucking oh. it up because it'll kill me. <laughs> I'm actually messing up. Wait. Guys, I'm about to film someone yeah, die. One more, or I die. After Lethal Company's preposterous levels of success, we were destined to get a couple more of these quirky co-op dance while you kill your friends type games. Okay, you can stop now. He's dead. And this is the first one that I think adds something new to the formula. It's called Content Warning, and within one day of being released, I already had someone recommending it to me as another Lethal Company, but instead of your quota being in money, it's in views. We have three days left to get 3,000 views. The goal is to go viral, as you can see on the planning board here. This is a game where the sole objective is actually creating a video with an in-game video camera. I got a little camera shy. He filmed me for like two seconds, and I started stuttering. <laughs> It would seem like an actual camera probably made me like forget how to talk. <laughs> this creates an interesting set of circumstances because it's purely driven by creativity. There's no real objective other than to make the video. Mike, I don't know how you make your guy move like that. It's terrifying. It looks like you're it looks like you're a person. It looks like you're mo-capped. It's so smooth. The only catch is it has to be a spooky video to go on Spooktube. Uh guys, I got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> and then cut and then I cut that's gonna that's gonna look real good on the final product you're basically making a ghost hunting show for the history channel could these gears be as some ancient astronaut theorists believe of extraterrestrial <laughs> And you do so as these downright adorable little scuba divers with emoticons for faces. I, uh, I don't like that one, I'll be honest. Maybe capital U's and a lowercase w? Which, there's definitely some diving lore behind this game because you also use a diving bell to start the run and reach the spooky area. Oh my god, you can hear the footsteps with the boom mic. Oh my what? God. It, barely, it barely fits. And the gameplay once you dive down to the Tim Burton space is pretty much wide open depending on the types of friends you have. Mike, pop on him. Pop on him. Pop on him. I'm popping. I'm popping. Are your friends camera shy? Ain't that right, Mike? Alrighty. Are your friends jackass fans? Go for it. Are your friends conspiratorial? Tonight on NBC News, just in, a second plane has hit the- Are your friends political? I am here with a local from Wuhan at the meat market. They have that soup. There's genuinely no objectives, no collectibles, no combat. There's nothing to do other than gather footage. Cinematography is my passion, and I just want to thank you for giving me an opportunity to spend my time pursuing my passion. The camera is the most valuable item in the game. Everyone else can die a horrific death, but as long as that camera makes it back to the surface, it's a win. Mike, drop the camera. Mike, drop it through you at me. I think the way this game is intended to be played is to try and record as much of the things that are trying to kill you as possible. Who's filming? Who is filming? Please tell me we're getting this on camera. He's gonna throw him at me! So it forces you into filming your friends dying, because as far as I can tell, that's the most efficient way to get views. Because again, all that matters is that quota, which is in views. Remember, we need 45,000 views, so this has got to be as, as engaging as we can make it. But the spawn rates are so crazy on these monsters that sometimes you're forced to make an episode of Ancient Aliens just because you can't find anything. Could these machines, as some ancient astronaut theorists believe, be of extraterrestrial origins? Oh. Oh! 
and other times you are constantly drowning in either snail men, man kitchen appliance hybrids, or little ghost guys with a knife. And those videos almost always end up being just a bunch of running and heavy breathing. I am almost dead. I'm getting out of here. I am the director. I have decided that I am now getting out of here with the camera, even though there's a lot. Because the only thing they give you to defend yourself in this game is a taser at the end of a stick. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> All of the other equipment in this game is very TikTok, which is to say completely useless. Oh, this is perfect. Mike, no, drop the camera. Drop the camera. Drop the camera. Drop the camera. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Go, go, go. No! It's a really great concept. I like making videos, but there's still so much more they could do with this game. Three, two, one. Hey guys, as you guys might have seen, our Wuhan video trended, but not in the way that we thought it would. It <laughs> it, it, it was offensive and wrong. And honestly, my main takeaway from content warning has kind of been Lethal Company should add a video camera. But that's cheating. Lethal Company has already made more money than God, and rightfully so. Scary story about how someone here died in a car crash, and sometimes you can still hear it. So far, I've only been able to make it to the second quota, but I take full responsibility for that. I don't think I'm playing this game correctly. Strangely arousing. As per my blood oath with Satan, I will be playing this game on Twitch today, the day that I post this, which means I'm about to make a stream about a video, about a game, about a video. Move to the right. Moose, move to the right. To the right. No. Which right? Your right? Your uh, right, right on the right? camera. Right on the camera. Move to the right. Like this? No, no. That's for the smooth brains who watch these the day that I post them. For everyone else, I just hope I was able to wire transfer you a giggle today. Guys, this is the content we need. Who's got the camera? Hey, hey, what's up? I've been your host, Jules Verne. Thank you for taking the time to watch my video about a game about a video about 9-11. And should you decide to give me the privilege of your time again in the future, then I will see you again... in the meat zone. It's a hot, it's fast, ninja. This is sick. Also, uh, yes, I would love to do that. I will email you. RxD with a slightly different spelling. Doug, comment below your favorite war crime. In our team, we're talking about raising the four dollars. Signed, granted by you. Wanted to be spooky. Dagonoth. And last but not least, Happy Feed Picks. Oh, wait, no, sorry, that's a question mark. Happy Feed Picks? Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Can we get quiet on set, please? Thank you. <laughs> nice. Nice.